Okay, welcome to the July 30th core team meeting. And the first item up is licensing terms for the forums. Nico. So I wrote up a draft of a comment and and after discussing with Mozilla Legal and after our discussion, uh, I am now running it. I ran it, I sent it to Mozilla Legal for feedback just to double check everything that was in it. And I didn't get an answer yet, so I didn't post it yet. Um, I have to remind them. But uh, the what I'm leaning towards right now, at least, is that we would keep the current setup but add a line that says if something is quoted, from and the, from another source which is cited, then it retains the license of that original source, which of course you know must permit reproduction in this forum. Um, and that I think addresses sort of the problem of like, well, I copied and pasted some code from the Linux kernel, and I didn't have the rights to do that because it's GPL and can't be relicensed as MIT or whatever, um, which is one of the hazards. And I think there's, I think that's probably the right outcome um but i'm going to post that proposal at least and, and see what people have to say about it i'm also the reason i wanted to make sure is i think i had some proposed phrasing and i want the legal team to double check it <laughs> but does your proposal when you say you're going to post it is that going to go through with these like common scenarios and explain how it applies uh yes i could do that in more detail but that it, is, it does try to do some of that. Maybe I'll right. add an explicit question, like <laughs> common scenarios. Um, I mentioned that only because if you don't do it in the post, they will try and do it in the comments and they might not do it with the clarity that you have from talking to people. So it could be a good way to help steer the combo. Yeah, I think that's a great idea. In fact, <laughs> Interpreting the law as like a group of people in the comments mm -hmm. usually can be complicated. <laughs> Right, right. Um, I think it's good to like to help drive the conversation, which I already tried to do, but explicitly around let's come up with like case story, like scenarios, <laughs> and we can define the outcomes we want and not worry, not try to write the rules. But, um, yeah, I think that makes a ton of sense. And giving, giving that direction thing, will be great. The thing that's not explicitly satisfied by this is the request of like, I. I post a comment and I don't want my thoughts being used for commercial gain. Um, that has to be explicitly disclaimed, but as a side effect, we can post things in RFCs and you can put things on Wikipedia and there's some other like. <laughs> um, are, are there forums that like by default, like GPL your comment? <laughs> no, our, our original terms was creative contribution, creative commons attribution, non-commercial share alike I don't know. I think. Oh, right. Yeah. But that that kind of puts us out of step with most licensing requirements, which tend to be I more. Think, open. Yeah, principle of least surprise here will be our friend. <laughs> um, the it's also license of the Wikipedia was uh, was the GNU documentation license, so yeah. It's in English. And like, it's kind of weird because our stuff is all licensed under Apache 2 MIT, but those are only ever intended for code, not for like non-code stuff. And so there's like weirdness. Yeah. Cool. All are right. you going to write up a paper doc for that, Nico, or no? I was going to post it in the issue, I guess, but okay. um, cool. I'll put it somewhere. We. <laughs> Side note that along the way when discussing this, we had originally been thinking about something like a try license where it's like license also under Creative Commons. And then we were like, okay, this is a little overkill. Let's just, uh, let's keep it simple. <laughs> but, I mean, if anyone doesn't like the license, they can post their stuff elsewhere that does have the license they want and they can link to it. They're right? also permitted to just stay in, you can all, all this is if, unless otherwise stated, right? So. If there's any yeah. particular thing that you're saying that you feel should be licensed differently, you can say so. Um. Okay, sounds good. Uh, any update on the compilers licensing stuff, Florian? No, I was sick last week. Um. Okay, uh, Rust survey 
Nico? Uh, no update. We, we created a channel <laughs> for chatting to start. Uh, target tier policy RFC, Nico? Oh. Uh, governance working group check in, Nico? No update since last week because we don't have a meeting this week. Okay, anyone have anything else for the public part of the meeting? Mm, yes, white paper moved. Um, oh. So, <laughs> um, there's an editing space now. Anyone who wants can um, can take part in that. It's a SharePoint somewhere. Uh, the problem is that the online editor for Word is not able to to deal with the white paper document, so you need a real Word license, which I own. Um, but anyone else who wants to collaborate also needs that. And it's already filled for like three, four pages. Wait, I didn't quite catch that. Like, you need a word license, did you say? You need the actual proper word uh, instead of using the online Google Docs like editor. It's a word template. And the online version, sadly, doesn't, isn't able to render it properly. So you need to have the actual desktop app. Okay, where do you find are we can Are we considering migrating the template to something that we can all collaborate on? <laughs> I think that's as much work as developing a new one. Uh, but right. we could do that if, if we feel like it's, it's worthwhile. Yeah, I think I would be recreating it. But... Um, I, was gonna say that I don't know how many people in this room have a word license, but yeah. <laughs> I, do, but I, I never find the uses for it, so this is sort of exciting, but I recognize it's also definitely a hurdle for participation. <laughs> yeah, I, I would say long term, if we want to be doing more white papers and have more people participate, especially having folks from other companies review the white paper before it goes out. This feels like it would. I mean, someone could render it in Word and export as PDF for review, right? Like that's not. Yes, that's perfectly yeah. feasible. So right, but they wouldn't be able to do like comments or collaborative editing. I don't know. I, I would like to flag it as maybe something that could help us move forward and have more people participate. Longer term, it would be a nice line. I, it's just, just a separate one. Uh, I have a question though. Where is that, or like you, you, you were collaborating with Nick, I think on that or something. Is that, is there a link? Where is it? Um, so I quickly put that on my share drive, uh, on, on, on my share point because I use it. Um, Currently, I gave Nick access to it because we were we too were editing it. Um, anyone else who wants access, or if you feel like I should give access to anyone from Core, I can do that later today or tomorrow. Yeah. Well, that's actually also a good reason to maybe at some point consider a, a different production process because. The project itself does not have a SharePoint or or something similar or Office 365. Wait, so you're saying SharePoint like Microsoft SharePoint server? Yes. Oh, goodness. Office 365, essentially. All right. Well, Microsoft, if you're watching the core team meeting, give us licenses or we're going to move to a different technology. <laughs> I think we can manage that. <laughs> All right, last call. Uh, Anything? Can you hear me? Yes. Can you hear me? Hi, okay. Pietro. Now it's better. Okay. Yeah. So, like, on the actual licensing, like, there was an a thing I wanted to work on eventually on the infrastructure team, which was to actually set up uh, a collaboration platform, like basically Office three three six five or Google or G Suite uh, for the Rust team uh, to get uh, a Google. Uh, document processing with actual permissions tied to the permit tied to the team repository, and also like uh, having eventually maybe an um, email address. So like actually getting that uh, license could be part of that effort if we actually start on that. 
It would be nice to have. It'd be cool oh. if that had a doc or something that wrote down exactly what the plan was. <laughs> All right. Um, I mean, like at the moment, it was just an idea on the infrastructure team, uh, so like it's not—it's uh, really far away. Just okay. Cool, cool. It. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna switch the recordings.